I would body condition score her between a one and a two, primarily because she's got atrophy all, all the way. You know, her neck is really thin everywhere. One of the interesting exceptions to refeeding syndrome are mares in early to mid lactation. When the body is producing milk, it prioritizes that baby over just about anything else, which is great for the baby, but it means moms not getting what she needs and she obviously didn't have enough nutrition during pregnancy either. So we can expect fewer side effects from feeding a mare that's lactating even in a really low body condition score than we could a horse that's not lactating because a lot of those calories are gonna get dumped straight into the milk, the carbohydrates and the fat. And so making sure that she's adequately hydrated is really key, but also making sure that she gets enough calories. Her gut sounds are mostly normal, which is great. She is just a teeny bit dehydrated, but it sounds like she was severely dehydrated when she was at the auction. So I'm happy that that's improving some and she looks like a really good mama. So, and baby looks very healthy. I didn't mess with him a lot, but she's doing a good job with him. Oh my goodness. Do you want to come home with me? How old do you think he is? How old do you think he is, Jenna? Like you just had months. you just had a baby horse. He looks smaller than your average three month old, but I think that he's not gonna be super big and I think that he's been I think he's a little bit delayed too. So I, I would agree with maybe two and a half to three. Nice to meet you. You're very precious. Oh my goodness, you guys. Oh. Get <laughs> my new Spock. Hello. Spock, that's a really great name. <laughs> this is the best job ever. I'm just gonna be in the stall for the rest of the day, Jenna. <laughs>